Hello folks, so this is uh, for 2018, October, November, paper 1-3 and the question number is 9. And it's the newest question that we have in <coughs> the market. So uh, in, in, the question says, a parachutist falls vertically from rest at time t equal to 0 from a hot air balloon. Hot air balloon. So uh, initially it is rest. Rest means that we must have v equal to 0 uh, at, at, at time t equal to 0. Uh, she falls for some distance before opening her parachute Parachute. So which graph best shows the variation with time t of the speed v of the parachutist? So one thing that we have to take here is that uh, Initially the velocity is zero Initially the velocity is zero. So that means that choice number a qualifies Choice number b qualifies and choice number c and d do not qualify Because they state that the initial velocity was some something not zero not zero. So both of them disqualify. Now the only choice remains A and B. So among that, uh, in A, what we have is uh, initially the velocity increases somehow uniformly, and then then the rate of increase decreases. The rate of change decreases. So that means uh, uh, that uh, the, uh, the 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 body, the parachutist, is being affected by air or the viscous force which it decreases the resultant velocity and so the resultant acceleration somewhere it is a path going towards terminal velocity so from then onwards uh, the velocity becomes constant which means that uh, the parachutist has gained terminal velocity so before it is terminal velocity the uh, acceleration decreases which means the rate of increase of v decreases and ultimately it becomes a equal to zero so choice number a seems to be the correct answer so at this point uh, the parachute opens so because of that the velocity decreases suddenly and it becomes uh, uniform somewhere at a reduced value so choice number a seems to be the correct answer regarding choice number b what it says is uh, the velocity increases uniformly in the beginning and then it then it then it increases even uh, rapidly even rapidly and suddenly becomes uniform so this is never correct so this is not the correct choice so choice number a should be the correct answer